or sell on Unitrade. Um, what we're going to do first is go to Unitrade.app up here. Uh, then we're going to search for the token that uh, we're interested in uh, making a sell transaction on. So uh, for illustrative purposes, we're going to use Unitrade, although I have no interest in selling trade at all. Um, once you choose the, uh, the token here, um, you're going to see it show up. We've got the price, um, and this is the most recent price here. First thing we're going to want to do, uh, most importantly, is connect a wallet. Uh, I use MetaMask, use Trust Wallet, and other uh, solutions as well. Please do not steal my passphrase um, and hack my wallet. Thank you. Um, so now that we are connected, you can see it says Ethereum mainnet up here. That proves that we are connected to the UI and to this uh, smart contract for Unitrade. And then here is the um, uh, the wallet address uh, for um, my particular wallet. So when you pull this up, you're going to see the balance for ETH, 0.3341. And then you're going to see a balance for trade of 24.6. Um, what we're going to do is we're going to want to go to sell because we're looking to sell. Um, and then uh, we're going to want to choose what our price is and then how many tokens we want to sell. So I have 24 tokens right now. Um, I'm not interested in selling all of them, um, but let's say I wanted to sell 10 tokens at the current price of 0.2338. Um, that would net me uh, $2.3 or 0.0041 ETH um, if I executed uh, this transaction at this price uh, for 10 trade. Now, if I want to change the price, uh, to something lower or to something higher because I don't want to sell this low. I want to sell at, say, $1. You'll notice that this amount here trades. We're working on getting that fixed um, so that uh, you don't have to do that and it changes the output. But for the time being, if you go back here and you just hit 10, like we talked about selling before, it will then update 10 times 1 is um, $10 US and 0.0179 ETH based on the current conversion rate. So uh, you just simply have to toggle um, this uh, token amount uh, to get back to um, you know the total output uh, if you had enough changing the price. Um, so this is a sell order. We're currently at 0.233 um, on the token. So I'm going to say at $1, we'll sell this thing. I'm going to say that I want to sell 10 tokens. Um, my total uh, price, uh, total value uh, that I'll receive is 0.0179 ETH. I can click next. Um, next, you're going to get to a processing uh, fee uh, page. So what we're doing here uh, is we're basically selecting um, uh, slow, medium, or fast. And slow is going to uh, be less gas that we're going to pay for this particular transaction. Um, as part of this processing fee, you're paying for gas. You're paying for a 0.2% unit trade fee um, for the transaction. And then you're also paying a little bit of a premium for limit order miners who are going to mine the order and execute it uh, quickly and efficiently, uh, essentially. So um, if you want to guarantee that your transaction is going to go through, the higher the gas um, and the higher the premium, the better chance that's going to be. Um, so... Uh, it's a little bit more expensive, but I'm willing to pay uh, fast and uh, up to 50 guay for this particular transaction. Um, so $9.37, I'm doing the max I can do. I'm gonna click next. You're gonna see a summary of the transaction, 10 tokens at a sell price of $1. So when it gets to $1, it's gonna sell um, my 10 trade. Um, I'm gonna receive 10 US dollars or 0.0179 ETH. Um, here's the processing fee that we just saw on the other page. Um, and then here's the total, 0.02 uh, uh, ETH. Uh, if I hit submit, um, the first thing you have to do is approve the transaction so that um, it can connect me with uh, the smart contract and the Ethereum blockchain. So uh, this is just the standard protocol for Uniswap or any of these other tools. Uh, you usually have to approve the transaction first. Um, and so we're going to go through there and click that. You'll get a confirmation message here with a Etherscan link um, so you can uh, confirm. Um, once that's uh, approved, I'm going to click Submit now, and this is going to allow me to submit the order. Now, notice um, uh, we have the uh, the total amount of the transaction is 0.0167 um, ETH, and then uh, there's also the uh, additional gas fee here uh, that we're going to need to spend. So um, this 0.0167 uh, is coming from here. This is the processing fee uh, that we discussed uh, earlier. So there's the gas, the unit trade fee, and then the premium for the miners. Um, that's this fee here. And so you're going to have to pay uh, to have this transaction put into the smart contract with Unitrade. And then there's also this transaction here, which is for Uniswap. This is the gas fee um, to place the trade into Uniswap. Um, so there's two transactions. Um, so uh, you have 0 0.0167 plus the 0 0.013. Um, I typically go to edit and I like to juice my gas to fast to ensure that the transaction goes through as quickly and efficiently as possible. Um, so I recommend that to people. Some people are more uh, cost conscious, so uh, keep that in mind. You can go slow, uh, average, or fast. Um, I'm going to click fast and spend a little extra. So here's my total, 0.022 ETH. I'm going to confirm the transaction. 
Um, and I'm going to get a message here. It says, thanks. It's going to give me the Etherscan link. Um, and basically, what we're going to do now is uh, we're going to sit here and wait for uh, a confirmation uh, that would come up right here uh, where it says success. Your order has been confirmed. My uh, screen was blocking that. So I'm just going to move this back down here. And as you'll see, um, we have that order placed. And if you go over here to this button, this is going to give you a summary of your orders. And as you can see here, we have our outstanding orders. Um, I have this outstanding trade ETH sell order here that we just placed, 10 trade. Um, and it's a sell order limit. The total value is $2.36 based on the current value of ETH. Um, and the limit uh, sell is at $1. So um, hopefully that gets uh, filled sooner than later. But uh, here we are. Uh, if you clicked on this button on the far right, it gives you a summary of the transaction. Um, selling um, uh, uh, Unitrade for Ethereum. Um, and uh, this is the, you know, the breakdown of the transaction at a $1 price, um, et cetera. Uh, and, this, and so uh, you have the breakdown of this order here and you can cancel it if you'd like um, as well. That's a benefit of this, uh, this uh, dashboard summary. So here's a list of the outstanding transactions that I have. Uh, I've got a, a, a nice, um, uh, a couple of buy orders and, uh, and a sell order here. Um, and uh, you can see it's just got a nice um, uh, breakdown. So I uh, hope you enjoyed the video. I hope this was helpful. Thanks.